Just believe in me like I believe in you. Quincy Jones always felt like something was missing in his life. So he quit his job in sales, joined the Peace Corps, and spent years working with the people of Mali, West Africa. One thing I learned is that everybody wants the same thing. No matter if you're an American, you're African, whatever. People really want to grow and be prosperous and really grow their community. So when I came back, I got back involved. Block clubs, president, volunteering at the community center. And then I said, I really want to start doing community organizing. That brought me over to the Osborne community. This pocket of Northeast Detroit is considered one of our city's poorest communities. But that doesn't stop Quincy from going door to door to get people involved. Let's say you knocked on my door. Well, I say my name is Quincy Jones, and we're here to work with you to make the community better. They didn't say the Quincy Jones? Well, they did say that. <laughs> they did say that. <laughs> Quincy's rallying effort brought the residents of Osborne together. They built the Matrix Center for youth in the community. They formed the Osborne Neighborhood Alliance. They boarded up abandoned buildings, cleaned up parks, partnered with area organizations to renovate homes, all to let people know. You can work, live, and play in Osborne. One thing you find about Detroit is people really want to make a difference. There's a lot of engaged residents, and if you don't have strong neighborhoods, you don't have a strong city. Won't give up on me. Just believe. Whether he's playing basketball with neighborhood kids or cleaning up the streets, Quincy Jones is spearheading a community movement right here in the heart of Detroit.